But first, we check back on that breaking news. Two buses sent from Texas dropping off dozens of migrants here in Chicago. Nate Rogers live once again at Union Station with the latest. Nate. Yeah, that's right, um, Corey and Don. It was about 60 people in total. Um, most of them were, were related, we're told, um, of course, working to escape the hardships and abuses of their native land. The migrants arrived here at Union Station around 7.30 in two large coach buses. Lots of single mothers were seen as well as small children. Many of the families, we're told, were from Venezuela. Now, Texas Governor Greg Abbott had emergency officials organize the drop-off effort, saying it's in response to President Biden's open border policies currently overwhelming border communities in Texas. Washington, D.C. and New York are sanctuary cities as well. Thousands of migrants have been bused here, bused there since the spring from the Texas border. Now, we did receive, of course, um, a statement from the mayor's office, that statement in part saying that Chicago is um, a welcoming city and will continue to collaborate with city departments um, and state departments to ensure that everyone arrives here will be greeted with dignity and respect. That group left Union Station just about an hour or so ago. Again, 60 people were in Straight total up. were told they were taken to a nearby shelter. That is the latest here at Union Station. Nate Rogers, Fox 32, Chicago.